Hi, this is Josh, Dream Body Clinic, and what you're gonna see here is me getting the intrathecal treatment. This is my second time doing it, and the last time I think was two years ago when I did it. It's a tough one to wrap your head around. This is an injection. It is a really tiny needle. It's about the diameter of an insulin needle. It's a 30 gauge, but it's a bit long, and it goes into your lower back into the spinal cord. So it's getting into the spinal cord fluid, which allows the stem cells to go up your spinal cord to the brain and start healing. So there's a lot of benefit to the spinal cord, which is gonna help your central nervous system, help with nerve pain, neuropathy. And then when it gets to the brain, it's gonna help boost the immune system there, get rid of debris, garbage, things that are getting in the way of connections. It's going to help with neurogenesis, guiding, the neurons to get to work and help with connections there in the brain. So it's really great for cognition. It's really good for focus. We see a lot of people that do it for things like traumatic brain injury, for stroke recovery, MS, we're seeing lesions heal. We're seeing a lot of cool things. I didn't do it for any of those reasons. I did it on the preventative side. My dad had Lou Gehrig's disease, so that's always kind of a concern for me. My grandma, my mom's side had Parkinson's, My uh, Grand, my grandpa on my dad's side had Parkinson's, so quite, you know, there's a history of neurodegenerative diseases. I don't want to be susceptible to those, prone. I think diet plays a huge role in that, so I really keep an eye on my diet. I think processed foods, things with too much, you know, like glyphosate, things are spraying on wheat. There's no way those are good for you. But there's a whole combo of things. So I start with diet, and now I've moved into using these stem cells to help me with these things to be preventative. I have found it helps a lot with cognition, helps me think more clear. Um, I did the treatment, it was a day and a half ago, and this experience is a bit different than last time. Last time I did it, I'd say the anesthesiologist that did it last time wasn't quite as good with the injection on that. I mean, it wasn't bad, it worked out fine, but he used to have us lay on our side. Even though it seems like a more comfortable position, it actually wasn't. This time, with the anesthesiologists that we work with now, I think they're much better at these treatments. They go in there at the bottom of the spine, and I'm kind of leaning forward, as you'll see in the video, and they go right in. I did not feel a thing. It was very simple, pain-free. You can tell something's in your back, but not much more than that. There was a slight, slight bit of pressure, but even that I could just barely, barely feel. And then she took the needle out. I mean, it was virtually nothing. Though mentally, it was tough to get my head around. Even doing this for the second time, and the first time didn't hurt at all either. And this time didn't either, so it was, you'd think, I'd be like, hey, this is an easy injection. But they're still going into your spinal cord. So it's tough to get your head around that and think that it's not going to hurt. So I was getting a bit nervous, I'm taking deep breaths, I'm getting into it, but I was able to do it, no problem, and go from there. Now the first time I did it, I got a bit of a headache later because I tried to keep working that day. This time I got a good solid headache. Um, I just think our cells just continue to get more potent, better. Uh, they're just great. So we took out some fluid to compensate, but you can feel some pressure building up from taking out some of that spinal cord fluid and then putting the stem cells back in. So I got a pretty good headache that lasted through the night, took some Tylenol, had a little bit of a fever, and that was it. By the next day, headache was gone, had a little bit of like uncomfortableness. It wasn't like, I've had sciatic nerve pain, it wasn't like that, but you could tell it had been into the spinal cord. So you just can't get comfortable, had a little bit of that, but again, took some Tylenol, that went away, and that was it. I had one night and part of the day that were a bit uncomfortable. And here I am today feeling great, no problem, making a video for you. So this is a great treatment for things like MS, traumatic brain injury, stroke recovery, um, and for just brain cognition. And that's what I used it for. I look at it almost like a nootropic. I wanna make sure my brain is optimized, that I can help more people, I can think clearly, make the right decisions, and do the right thing for our patients. So that's why I did it. I think uh, if you've got questions, you should get a hold of us. You can call us anytime, toll free at 833-445-9089. You can check out the website, www.dreambody.clinic.
yeah, that's the intrathecal treatment. Look, I don't have anything wrong, but my dad had Lou Gehrig's disease, so everything is preventative for me. And yeah, I, I want to make sure I've got my brain at full optimized you know, potential. Last time I did this was two years ago, and the cool part was I started having some crazy dreams right away after. Got a bit of a headache the day of. Yeah, but for about half an hour, an hour, I took a tram and sat and went right away. For some people, it can last longer. For me, it wasn't bad. Hopefully, I won't get one today because I'm going to rest. I'm going to relax. I'm going to lay down. But yeah, I started having crazy dreams a few days after treatment. And then after that, it went back to normal. But now I remember dreams. Almost daily, I wake up and I can remember a dream or two for the night before. So I know it helped my brain before memory. Hoping it'll be even more this time. You know, with my dad having the Garrett's disease in the past, I'm gonna do anything I can to maintain my brain health. And I do these treatments too, to show you at home that we know we have the best stem cells in the world. And we wanna be able to prove that. I don't want you thinking we just say it, we live it. I do these treatments, my wife does these treatments. She runs all the finance and management here. Um, our kids have done these treatments, my mom's done these treatments, my brother's done these treatments, my uncles have done these treatments, aunts have done these treatments. I mean, extended family too. Yeah, we, we don't just, you know, I guess we practice what we preach is kind of the way to put it. So if you'd like to learn more, get a hold of us. I'm Josh, happy to help.